Hello everyone and welcome to Star Stable. Today is an update day and it's quite an interesting update actually. Today I am on my more worry, which I never expected honestly. Uh, today uh, we got the Horses of Yorick again and this time we have a discount on these beautiful Akaltiks and more worries. Uh, however, uh, Akaltiks are 533 star coins, I believe. And Marvaris are 750 star coins. However, I don't think I will be getting an Akaltik. The reason why I decided not to buy them is because... Well... I have 807 star coins and I buy stable care, so... Um... Yeah, fuck. Uh, let's check out the rate. Oh my god, no. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Did you see that? Holy shit! Uh, also, I must men fuck no that. Uh, I must mention how freaking annoyed I am uh, because hello there. My name is Yeah, and I'm one of the founders of the Cushions of Fury Focus Races. Uh, blah blah blah. It's the same thing. Yes. Uh, yes. Um, I... Oh my god, I am really... Hey guys, I need to talk about this. This course looks beautiful, right? It does. It really does. Okay, the grazing is always fucked up uh, with Star Stable, but... The walk... Eh... I guess it's fine. The rear is fine. The backwards is uh, okay. Uh, the special animation is nice. But then, guys, then it starts getting really weird. This is my favorite thing about this horse. The turning. This is so cute. This is my favorite thing. Uh, but then, look at it. I mean,. I am not a fan of this anymore. I think the horse... And as we go further, uh, the horse looks more fucked up. Like... The neck is really bothering me, okay? What is that? Like, why is it so weird? And this is a bit weird, yeah? I will do this race... But I will collect the experience with another horse that I'm training because I'm not wasting 500 XP. Fuck that. So I think it's the same race, but yeah. I think it's just quite fast though. I'm pretty happy to go to the ground, but it looks really fast. Yeah, this is the hero's moment. This is the fastest horse. Especially when I'm looking at the fastest jumps. Yeah, it really jumps quite fast. I'm not sure if it's going to be the majority of the fastest. I'm not very fast, yeah. I remember adoring this horse. This was the first horse I actually bought as soon as it came out. And since this horse, I was able to... I'll be back. No, I'm not gonna talk about what I just did. No. Okay, now that we are out of this fucking place. Okay. Apparently, there's something in Weldale Village. Yeah, thank you very much. I have somewhat of a memory. So let's go there. Alright, I'm finally here. I- I- oh my god. Wait, what? It's completely frozen? Alright. Uh. Oh, I love the fucking sound. Oh my god, this is so cool, dude. God, I wish you could see my face this episode. This freaking episode of Star Stable. I really wish that you could see my my face, guys. What is this? This is a series of exciting squeaks and squacks. Well, desperate to try to use uh, his flippers to depict sliding on ice, it looks like he wants to race down the frozen river. Shh! 700! Yes, I changed my course because I 
I have too many horses to train. I love the ASMR if it wasn't for this music. Can we even- oh my- oh my god, that's... Okay? Are we sliding though? Can we slide? No, really. That's a bit of a shame. Oh. Fuck, I almost missed that. Holy shit, my friend is here. So, I need to finish the recording video and I need to open the doors. So. Yeah, ah, fuck. That's so nasty, dude. Oh my lord! <laughs> no, holy. Oh god, thank you. <laughs> Please, is he fucking up? That. That's actually kind of creepy, isn't it? Okay. No. Dude, my friend is waiting out in the cold. Can this phrase be over? Please. Okay, guys, we're done. Uh. What is happening? Flapper looks ecstatic to see you. She claps her flappers in celebration. She's clearly trying to express that you have all the ice sliding grace of the Master Pinion. Cool! This was very exciting. We will continue to continue the video a bit later, guys. Be right back. The next day. Alright, everyone, I'm back. And it's actually been a whole day. I usually never do this, but. I had to continue the recording the next day. And I'm kinda curious, before we go out of here, I'm very curious, how does this ice end? You know what I mean? <laughs> how does- oh. Oh, actually it's not bad. It's actually very nice. I was expecting honestly a flat line, but this is cool, I like it. Alright, so, hope this won't be too long, because we have some stuff to check okay, out. While we're here, at, and while I'm going to check out the race in the Winter Village, I just want to inform you guys that horses from the Steve's farm are moved to Lower Paddock Island. And the horses that are moved are second generation Frisians, the second generation Hanoverian, Hanoverian? <laughs> the third generation Yorick Warmblood, and the third generation Lusitana. So Lusitana really does not feel that much like a third generation, honestly. Um, and the. Jesus, it's so loud. Uh, the, the third generation Yorick Warmblood, too, but I love how as soon as the Yorick. Yorick Warmbloods um, arrived to the game, we didn't give them much love, did we? Maybe I'm wrong, but I do have this feeling. Like, my first reaction was, like, I'm never gonna fight the horse. Because. Oh! Uh, this is the one, right? Oh, we have two quests. Okay, okay, let's check them out. Let's check them out. <laughs> Hi there, I'm the leader of the Arctic Fox Protection Team. Have you ever heard about us? No? Let me tell you about our work. Arctic foxes are cute wild animals, also known as snow foxes, polar foxes, or white foxes. As they are common in the Arctic regions, there are some, there are some living on Yorick, although their number is very small. Our team takes care of the foxes here in the Winter Village. 
If you're interested in learning more about Arctic Fox, I'm sure the team would love to share their experience. Expertise, I'm sorry, with you. We are fascinated by these foxes, which is why we volunteer our time to monitor their population health. Let me work on your map where one of my scouts is. Mark, what am I? What is wrong with me today? <laughs> then come back when you when you talk to them. All right. It's uh, that one over there. Okay, okay, where are we at? Fuck them. No. I'm so lost. I'm so confused. Oh yes, the props. We got the props, guys. Oh, that looks fancy, dude. Oh, I like it. I really like it. Nice. Here we are. Hi. Do you want to know my favorite fact about Arctic Foxes? There are two color morphs of Arctic Foxes, white and blue. Let me tell you something mind-blowing. White foxes change to a brownish color during summer. Yes, I knew this. However, we have not observed that camouflage adaptation on our Yorick Foxes. I'll mark where my next teammate is so you can talk to her. Why are we doing this again? Howdy! I'm studying the impact of the environment on our animal friends' homes. Say, did you know that white and blue arctic foxes live in very different habitats? White arctic foxes live inland and blend in with the snowy tundra. Blue arctic foxes live along the coasts where their darker color blends in with the cliffs and rocks typically found in the region. I'll mark where my next teammate is so you can talk to her. Okay, while we're at it, I'm gonna check this quest out. Hey there, we're hosting a very special race this season. It takes you on a beautiful journey through the woods and over the frozen lake. But watch for penguins. They live nearby and could cross the track at any moment. Ooh, 150 character experience? Let's go! Oh my lord, guys, do not miss out on these quests. Oh my god. Oh, hello. They, they do be scary sometimes. Their movement is a bit weird. You might. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh god. They're rabid. Oh god, they're rabid. Oh my god, stop. <gasps> Fuck. Oh, oh god. <gasps> Look at the traps! They're so good! Oh my lord. Am I the only one that's so amazed by everything? Oh god. Oh fuck. Oh wow, it's a quite a, quite a long race, I must say. How did you do? Good news, you can race it again every day. How awesome is that? Hell yeah! Oh my god, I'm almost at the half of level 22! Isn't that exciting? Imagine- dude. When you run, the tracks are very nice. There we go. But maybe they should update the tracks more, I guess. Anyways. Hey, thanks for coming over. I've been tracking the number of Arctic foxes so we can monitor their population. It is estimated that there are fewer than 200 adult Arctic foxes in all of Norway, Sweden and Finland. However, the total popula population of Arctic foxes is several hundred thousand animals. This means Arctic foxes are not currently endangered Though they are not com completely safe yet, therefore our team is making an effort to improve their situation. I'll mark where my next teammate is so you can talk to her. Oh my god! Yeah. Cool. I guess this is faster now. Well, thanks! Hi, visitor! 
I read some interesting facts about the Arctic foxes' senses. Listen to this. Though Arctic foxes have a slightly inferior hearing uh, acuity? Compared to some domestic dogs, they, they can smell raw meat thousands of kil kilometers. Oh my god, I can't read. Kilometers away, and barely feel any cold in their paws, even when walking over ice. Incredible. I'll mark for my next teammate is so you can talk to her. I'm so happy about it, can't you tell? The sound. The, this area is so well done, I, I have to take a lot of pictures. <laughs> Hey you, have you ever wondered how arctic foxes can walk on ice? Arctic foxes are the only canids whose paws are completely covered in fur. Isn't that paws positively adorable? See what I did there, haha. <laughs> Moreover, an arctic fox maintains a higher temperature in its paws than in the rest of its body so that the tissue in the paws does not freeze. Now you've met the whole team! Oh, thank goodness! Go back to our leader, she surely has more awesome things to share with you. You're back, did you enjoy meeting the team? Now that you've completed this trek to learn about Arctic foxes, I'd like to tell you about a really remarkable journey. In 2019, a female Arctic fox traveled from Norway all the way to Canada through Greenland and the Arctic Pole. How? In an incredible 76 days, she averaged 46 kilometers per day with tops of 155 kilometers a day. What a journey, right? Thanks so much for your time. It's the interest of people like you that help us preserve these adorable arctic foxes. Let's take care of these wild animals together. Damn! But for why? Frigid Arctic Fox and Hardy Arctic Fox. And they're hella expensive, so I'm not getting any. So, well, guys, I wanna check the freaking two quests that we randomly have. Oh, well, this one I know, but what is this about? I mean, I know I checked it out, but I make sure I did everything. Okay, guys, I think that my quest is kinda bugged. Or something, because this is the quest, but I already did it, so I don't know why it's there. Anyways, that would be it for today's, or yesterday's update, well. And I hope you enjoyed, I will try to edit this as fast as possible. Probably the video will be up later this evening, I'm not quite sure, but I hope so. And uh, see you guys next time, bye bye!